Hello, my name's Joe Johnson and I have helped over 30,000 people with their dental implants. That is, I've reduced their suffering, reduced the dental implants infection and I've reduced a lot of pain. Um, if you go onto YouTube and type in dental implant problems or secrets, you will see my video that's been watched over half a million times. It, there's a number of uploads. I've helped over 30,000 people specifically to reduce the infection that they've experienced after dental implants. Now, I would say if you're thinking of having a dental implant procedure, do your homework, check it out, but by all means, go ahead. I've gone ahead in the past. I've, I think I've got nine dental implants and now I've got a fantastic set of teeth, but I'm also very much aware of the problems that you can have if you get dental implants. Now, assuming you've checked your dentist out and they've carried out the procedure before and you're happy with the price, you're happy with everything, you're just checking it out, this is what I'm here to tell you. Assuming your dentist has done a good job, he's took the old bones out, he's put your new implants in, he's done the gum surgery, everything looks fine, and I'm sure it is most of the time. But a great number of people get gum infection after a dental implant procedure and this gum infection can be extremely painful it can stop you from working it can stop you from eating it can stop you from drinking it really is bad news and here's a picture of me of what i looked like after my first dental implant procedure So as you can see, things can and do go wrong. But there's a lot that you can do. When you go and have your implant, uh, they'll very often recommend that you have a course of antibiotics. Usually amoxicillin or metronidazole. And they'll very often give you two or three grams to take straight away. This is because they know there's a good chance of infection. They'll give you a lot of antibiotics straight away and then they will tell you to take antibiotics for about a week. At the same time, your dentist will encourage you to swill your mouth out with um, an antiseptic mouthwash. Um, that's one there that they recommend in the UK. They could also recommend that you massage into your gums uh, these gels. It's just to keep the germs down. Because if you can get if you get an infection in your gums and the implants there, it can get into the jaw, all kind of things can go wrong. And it did do for me. And the first time I had dental implants. Some dentists might even encourage you to have a, a swill round with hydrogen peroxide solution. Again, to help you keep the germs down. Now, I'm a herbal researcher. I've been working in natural remedies and herbal research for nearly 25 years and when i had my gum infection and the antibiotics didn't work and then the second lot of antibiotics didn't work in the end i thought i'm just gonna have to do my own thing here and i knew that there's a specific blend of natural antibiotics and i i mix them together and i massage them onto the gums and literally within a couple of hours the infection started to go down Within a couple of days, the dental implant was perfect. The infection had gone. Now, since then, and since I've shared this on YouTube a couple of years ago, 30,000 people who have had dental implants have used this remedy. When I send it to you, it's wrapped here. That's it. It's just a simple remedy called Gum Doctor. Gum Doctor. It's specifically designed for gum infection. Stops your gums from bleeding, stops all the bacteria in your mouth. It just kills it without damaging your immune system. And all you do is this. It's a very thick, powerful liquid. You just put a few drops onto the tip of your finger and you massage it into the gums. Massage it into wherever you've got the stitches. I don't know if you can see that on the camera there just a few drops of the liquid 
and you massage it into your gums two, three times an hour. When you first get it, massage it in, and then three times a day. Within two or three days, your infection will be gone. Your mouth infection will be gone. Now, many of the 30,000 people I've helped have actually suggested that they get it before you have your implants, have it ready. Have it ready. Because what you don't want to be doing is waiting while you've got a roaring infection. And you don't want to be damaging your immune system with too many antibiotics at one course after another after another. Get the gum doctor, go and have your implants, come home and just put a couple of drops on. Remember, your body will react to the surgery, the, the dental implant surgery, it will. You'll become inflamed. The last thing you want is an infection on top. Especially if you're spending a fortune on dental implants. I know how much they cost. They cost thousands. And there's no guarantee. Your, your dentist won't guarantee you. Where's that? I was going to show you this. This is from my own dentist. There's a whole list of things that can go wrong. Of there's a when when you get dental implants, they'll ask you to sign this, sign this, sign this, sign. Basically, they are not responsible because they know the things that can go wrong. And one of the major things that can go wrong is infection. Infection. That's why this remedy will help you. It's called Gum Doctor. Click the link below the video. If you're even thinking of having a dental implant procedure, get the gum doctor, get it ready, have the have the implants. I mean, they're fantastic. So much better than dentures. So much better than having teeth with fillings or teeth that are weak and loose. And you. Dental implants are fantastic. But the procedure is painful. <laughs> the, the infection is painful. I'll put it that way. So make sure... You're protecting your gums with the gum doctor. All right, we'll get it sent out to you straight away. If for any reason you're not happy with a gum doctor, we always have done for the last 25 years, for the last 22 years, given a money-back guarantee. It's a 100% money-back guarantee. It will work and it'll protect your gums. All right. Any questions, just get in touch on the website, teethneedgums.com. The link is below this video. If you have any questions at all, get in touch, and I look forward to helping you. Bye for now.